Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to install the Trailer Life Pathway backup camera from Camping World. Let's get started. We'll be installing the backup camera on our fish house today and we'll need our trusty screwdriver, a wire stripper, and a drill. First, I'll need to scout out the back of the camper to search for a good DC power source because I'll need to tap into that. The box comes with adapters to make it simple, but you'll need to splice into the light. In this case, I've chosen the top central light because that's closest to where my camera will go. I'd recommend pilot holes if you are drilling into metal, but for this application, I'm just going to screw directly into the exterior. I'm also going to make a hole for the camera wiring, which I'm going to snake down to the light. Make sure you have the gasket fitted flushly to the camera back to make sure it's waterproof and doesn't leak. So you might run into this issue too, but our first hole we hit a stud, so make sure to use a stud finder first. So our second hole we were able to snake the camera wire all the way through. Fortunately the gasket will cover both holes and it will be watertight either way. I identify my neutral wire and my black wire, which in some cases will have a green stripe. Right, now I'm going to attach positive to positive and negative to negative. I'm putting some electric tape around the connections to make sure they stay in place. Now I'm going to attach the power adapter to the camera adapter cord. So now all I have to do is plug in the monitor to a power source. All right, so push the power button there, turn on your monitor. And there it is, we have a connection. You want to make sure your light is waterproof. So in this case, I have some butyl putty on my light. In other cases, you can use a thin bead of silicone. Stuff it back in there. All right, screw it in. And that's it. This camera is easy to set up, gives you a great view as you're backing up into spaces, and I'm really excited to use it.